I'm Jaime Rosaduke. I am a clinical assistant professor in the Department of Pediatric and Adolescent Medicine at the University of Hong Kong. So I completed my undergraduate MD-PhD program, pediatric residency, and then immunology and allergy fellowship in the United States. And then after that, in terms of my long-term career, I explored Hong Kong, the University of Hong Kong, because I have some family here and I know it's one of the best clinical and research institutions in the world. I I emailed our current dean, Professor C.S. Lau. He was very good at replying emails to me and giving me really good advice about what to do. And also Professor Yulang Lau in the pediatric immunology group. They were very welcoming to me and really convinced me to really consider coming back. And then when I came back to meet with them, they and other colleagues here gave me very good advice about how to qualify for medical license and specialty here. And so I was able to go through through all of those obstacles in the past couple of years, really thanks to them. And I'm fully licensed in Hong Kong and I've decided to stay at the University of Hong Kong to continue doing this line of work because I really enjoy it. When I first came back, Professor Yulang Lau and other senior faculty really basically had an open door policy where I can go into their office anytime and ask questions and seek help. That was wonderful and very helpful in terms of starting up here. My field is immunology, basically the immune response to infections or vaccines. When COVID happened, it was a major concern as a pandemic. We went into that area trying to find the best vaccine basically for our community. Professor Yulang Lau has been really involved in that area and he really helped me pick up uh, research in vaccinology. We did a lot of uh, very good work along with Professor Pierres from School of Public Health, Professor Tu from our department, and these are virologists and T-cell experts. I really got to have a chance to work with these excellent collaborators and doing excellent work in COVID vaccination. I'm very grateful for the University of Hong Kong for having a mentorship scheme to help junior faculty. I was paired with Professor Sophia Chan. She's a major figure in public health, and she gave me a wide range of advice that was very helpful, um, including how to get grants, promotion, and the best way to achieve a good work-life balance. At the University of Hong Kong, I have a variety of roles and that is excellent because it allows me to connect, contact, network and collaborate with so many wonderful people.